Yo, what's going on, everyone? Move this down a little bit. Get everybody in there. Doing a live feeding time here. I'm uh, breaking a 28-hour fast. I don't know if I like. Let's go right there. I got two Chipotle veggie burritos with white rice here. And uh, I've been fasting for 28 hours. I'm a little bit uh, woozy. I've got my... Cotton candy finish at BCAAs. This is going to break the fast. Oh, I went deep into this one today, guys. And I go, you know what? I'm going to do a live video breaking my fast. Here, it's been a busy day. And uh, welcome. So I got a little bowl of salsa here as well. Again, there's about 1,700 calories in this Um in this meal, I think 17, around 17, 1,720, if I'm not mistaken. And I typically need about 4,000. I can go over that a bit too, um, but I no activity today either. So again, I'll have one more meal tonight. I'm not even going to hit my calories, obviously, for the day. So, um, but yeah, let's just dive in, guys. A lot going on, a lot to talk about. As always, welcome everybody. Welcome to this live feeding time. Watching the gorilla eat. We've opened the window for the people to, to view. Please, please do not touch the gorilla while he is eating. You may lose a finger. Mm, oh yeah. Oh, I'm happy. Woo! This was a long one, guys. Oh, these Chipotle burritos. When you go do those fast, it really, really slows down time. You want to slow down time, guys? Planks, Stairmaster, and uh, fasting. Three ways to slow down time right there. Son of a bitch. Got five days left, guys, on the YouTube video for my $500 prize for Feed Me More Nutrition. Literally giving $500 away in the everything stack, which I think is like $349 or $379 value on that, too. Click on the video for the $500 giveaway. You have until Friday to purchase one supplement, and you're eligible. I'm announcing it on here on Saturday. Then we're doing a bigger prize. So if you want need five hundred dollars, all you have to do is buy one supplement and you're eligible. Oh. But you need to watch that video to get the code. The code's on the comment. The comment will be on this one too to get that code to become eligible for fifteen percent off. Mm. Food's the way to my heart, guys. You always hear those stories. You never want to talk to Vince without him eating. Very true. I'm the same way. Don't want to do business with me unless I'm, I'm well fed. Homemade salsa here. Just look at it. 1,700 clean calories right here. We've got some healthy fats with the guacamole. This is a man's burrito. Edward Burrito Hands. Don't hate me. Ah, yeah. Thank you guys for all the love and support on this channel as well. We should start going up in views again, doing only food videos. 
Oh, this is a messy one. Thank God I'm not eating this in the truck. Or the car, damn. Look at this mess. Hold on, I gotta drop it. Damn it. Luckily, I got a spoon. Good to see all of you guys in here. Ah. Ooh. Luckily, I brought a spoon. I can eat it right, right out of the little bowl. Bowl of salsa. Oh, this is delicious. Oh, man. I just saw my stem cell doctor today, too, guys. A lot of great news going on for me. I know the world's going to shit. California's shutting back down. <clears throat> but great news. We're actually doing the stem cell on my nerves of my leg. Um, because we don't know what's going on with Columbia as far as going to bio accelerator in September. And so I'm just moving forward. I got these procedures done here on my back and shoulder. I'm feeling great. I'm in the best shape I've been in in probably four years with everything. And, uh, got some really, really great stuff going on. I just got to be able to, I got to get that leg procedure done to get my, my function back in my foot that I never had my whole career. I have devoted myself to getting health back with all of this. And um, it paid off. Overcoming, it literally never been done before. They looked at my MRIs. We've regrown five discs in my back. My right shoulder that needed to be completely replaced is functioning and doing things that I haven't been able to do in many, many years. I have no pain. And uh, I've been truly blessed. So I thank you guys for your love and support. And I promise you when I'm able to get back, it's going to be fucking badass. Shout out to Chris Jericho as well. He had very kind words today. He's always been great. He's, uh, he's a true leader. And uh, I hope people uh, would believe and respect his word over CM Punk's all day long. And that as far as wrestling goes, uh, and I've devoted my entire life to it and had and killed myself <clears throat> for one guy to come out and uh, who had a personal issue. And uh, a lot of people believed it when nobody else, that was never the case with anybody else. And um, you would you would have heard if it was. So Chris was always great with me. We had a lot of fun matchups. I got to work him when I was healed. And uh, I truly wish I could have wrestled him at WrestleMania with all that. But the past is the past. A lot of lessons were learned and all that. I wouldn't have what I have right now. I wouldn't have the mindset I have right now. Had I not experienced all that, and you know, I, I wrestled for a year with arena shaking and experiencing being the top baby face and uh, been very blessed, very, very rare opportunity that very few individuals ever get to do in their career and, and, and thrived in that role and just did everything asked of me. And uh, I truly believe. And when I left, I knew I had an opportunity to leave and that and get my health right. If I was able to get it right, it would create a very rare opportunity that does not really go on that much in wrestling anymore with guys leaving. And uh, because we all, and I, this was for me watching as a kid, the most badass part of wrestling for me was, was seeing fucking somebody come back, especially with some uh, you know, it's just, it, it, it's a way to create, it takes a real story and real emotion and it allows you to feel it in an environment. That's what makes pro wrestling special is when you can make people feel real emotions in a setting that, that is obviously entertainment, uh, but there's very real, real elements to it. And uh, I'm looking forward to eventually seeing what happens because it's going to be, like I said, fun badass. Mm. 
And I'm still going to do these videos here like a fucking loser. And it's going to really blow some. How does this guy rattle and do food reviews? How does he do it? He's a loser on Monday, but on fucking Wednesday, he's a fucking champion. <laughs> he's a loser, after I? <laughs> Oh, man. It was a real mess. Good to see all of you guys. Thank you guys for watching the Gorilla Eat. I'm going to dump a little salsa in here. You guys may have heard also. Hold on. I'm going to take a few more bites. Oh, Ryback is the worst wrestler to live. That's the first comment I see. Well, thank you for watching my videos, buddy. I'm a horrible eater. I've never read a bad comment where I've ever been, like, fucked up over. Where I'm like, man, that guy really doesn't like me. It's always funny to me. Because I know they're fucking losers. <laughs> but that ride back really sucks. His ass crack is hanging out, 400 pounds. Those are against people like that, only if they talk shit. I mean, why would you like me, though? I'm fucking jacked. Fucking great looking. Get chicks easy. My nickname's the big guy. I would hate me, too, if I wasn't there. You guys, my goal is also with everything, there's a lot going on. I need all of your love and support. We're moving the Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report to Patreon exclusively. It's not going to be on audio or Ryback TV anymore. And the, Ryback, the conversation with the big guy Ryback is now rebranded as the Ryback Show. My buddy Chris Van Vliet, uh, we had a long talk on this week's podcast. And uh, it was in his suggestion and we, and we just talking and going over things. Um, but with some things I got going on with the, the trademark, uh, your love and support is greatly appreciated on Patreon. Um, my goal is to get to 5,000 subscribers on there. We have two different tiers. And hopefully we get to 10,000 subscribers um, because some stuff is going to cost a lot of money coming up. And uh, I'm not going to slow down the growth of uh, Feed Me More Nutrition. Um, it, it's really going to – it could be a real pain in the ass. And uh, I'm not – doing a GoFundMe or anything like that. We just want to move the Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report. If you guys want to support the podcast, it is uh, greatly appreciated. And uh, it is for a great, great cause, I assure you. Shut up and eat the food. Ryback, how much is immune system support? Our kick-out immune system support is $29.99, but we have a buy one, get one free if you use discount code HEALTHY, and uh, we give you 60 days for $29.99. I haven't been sick in over seven and a half years on it, guys, So, but it's uh, and everything we sell is all, is all top of the line. No bullshit, no gimmicks, nothing. It's all top of the line. I know I use wrestling names and terms, but I'm a wrestler. You're not gonna find better plant. You're not gonna find better supplements on the planet. I promise you. There are much bigger companies than me, but none of them are doing what we're doing and going to be where we end up. So, and I, I want to change that entire industry. I get one dollar of every sale to three square to feeding the, the homeless and those in need in Las Vegas. And that's on our website. And we update that monthly. I do believe in giving back. 
and having business and leading by example. Even when you know you want every dollar to go into your business, um, I believe you need to set a good example. As I'm just a filthy little man eating in front of you. I've never looked at eating. Like some people are eating so personal. I'm like, well, we do it all in the open. You know, I think I think sex is personal. And I'm not over here. I'm not doing an OnlyFans, rubbing guacamole all over my tits. It's not a bad idea. Would you guys subscribe to an OnlyFans if it was just like food based, but sexual, but not all the way? Just weird videos. One video, it's garlic butter sauce all over the body. Next video, it's guacamole. Just a filthy OnlyFans for food. Nah. Phoenix Marie making it up there. <laughs> My food is gone, dude. What a weirdo. You just come here to watch me eat? Fucking weirdo. You talk too much. These are talking videos, guys. The food is just the... Uh, these, these videos are for me. I don't know about you. This is only what I want to do. Oh. All right. Done. There we have it. Just broke a 28-hour fast, guys. With uh, two monster... Chipotle veggie burritos, 1,720 calories. Let's call it 1,750 with the BCAAs and the salsa. I ate the entire bowl of salsa. So not a bad first meal. I got to do one more here. I actually got to do some work. I got to walk the dogs. It's been 100. It was 112 degrees here today. It was 115 yesterday. It's hot as balls. It's still hot. It was 105 degrees, I think, at night last night. Uh, like at midnight or something ridiculous, like going outside in the dark and it's just the dogs. I could only walk a really short period They're Little Sophie and the little guy gets so tired, but you got to be really careful with little dogs like that. But I thank you guys very much for watching. It was great to see you guys again. I do have another Ryback has heat video coming up this week. Uh, the 6 million Scoville heat unit block, black block, black mamba, black mamba, mamba sauce will be the hottest sauce that I've tried yet. I'm going to do it straight, straight in the mouth, guys. That's what she said. It's going to be, it's going to be hardcore. And uh, thank you guys very much again for watching and uh, have a great night. And uh, let's all remain calm and hopefully stay positive and optimistic. Um, yeah, we'll talk again. All right, guys. Good night. Feed me more.